It's going to be ugly in the beginning. What's going on guys, Armando Gong here, back with another video here to just share some of my musings from my own personal journey. Now, I thought about this topic because as you know, I've been making a couple videos more on my personal YouTube channel trying to just share some of the thoughts and experiences I'm having in my own journey. And one of the things that really came up for me today was the fact that a lot of the things that you start doing in whatever you, you pursue is going to be rough in the beginning. I thought about this as I'm trying to learn more about how to make my videos better, how to start creating a better brand, how to have a better message, and how to get my message out across more so, so I can help more people. And it's like, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing here. It's like, I am literally right now creating a video in the car. Op the lighting is not optimal. I don't have any special camera. I'm only using my iPhone right now. I don't have any mic, etc., etc. Production value is not the best. But at the same time, I am making these videos as a first step. And as I get more into this and, and refining the process for myself, there, there are many ways I can try and improve along the way. And I think that for anybody pursuing any new pursuit, that's what you're going to hit. It's never going to be perfect right off the beginning. And if it was, is that going to continue riding through the entire experience? Most likely not. You're probably going to hit some road bumps along the way, not knowing what to do maybe, or it's taking a lot more effort than you expected it to, but a lot of these obstacles that you were probably not in, planning on encountering. And I think you need to know it's okay. Like we all go through this when we first start trying something new out. Otherwise, if there are no hardships or any hard things that we encounter, what the hell is the point of even trying to that new pursuit out? Um, I think something that's also really relevant or uh, relatable is that whenever you're going to the gym that first week, you're in your personal trainer or you start a new workout, you are going to be sore. Like there's no way around it because most likely you have not been, uh, your body has not been adapted to that training load or stress. And like you get back into the gym, you probably go way too hard or you're probably too super excited. So you do a bit more exercising than you used to. And then you're probably, you probably be achy and sore the rest of that week. But you stick to the routine, you go back the next week, and then the next week, and then you start slowly upping your frequency, how many times you go during the week. And eventually, you're gonna be like wondering how if you even get sore in general. And that's part of the process, you know, you got, there's gonna be some rough bumps in the beginning, but then as you put in your time, put in your reps, put in your 10,000 hours, those bumps are gonna slowly smooth out. You're not, it's not saying that you're not going to hit more bumps along the way, but those bumps, instead of being big mountains in the beginning, which they might be, might slowly smooth out to be like little gentle rolling hills to even just little small up and downs. That's really what I wanted to share for today. Just stick with your journey. You're gonna hit some bumps in the beginning. And it's okay to fall and just get back up from it and learn. And there's no going around skipping this process. Every famous entrepreneur, every good athlete, anybody who has created something for themselves has to go into this, put in your reps, put in your time, put in your hours, and take those bumps, learn from them, and slowly improve yourself as the day goes on. That's what I wanted to share for today. Again, my name is Armando Gong. If you like this video, please leave a comment below. I would really like to get back to you guys. And please subscribe and click the notification bell to uh, hear more about for my channel. Thank you very much. Take it easy. Later.